Hey, uh, Jalen, can you hear me okay? I can. Uh, Jalen, uh, first of all, how was it to get that victory after a four-game skid? Yeah, it uh, feels tremendous. It feels like, you know, I think obviously we really needed that one. It felt good to have it. It felt good to just um, being in the game, just uh, relearning, relearn how to uh, finish out the game, you know what I mean? Uh, finish with the dub, all that kind of stuff. You know, winning in the league is hard. So to be able to close out these wins like this after, like you said, the last couple of weeks has been important. It's been big and, and also just moving forward and, and growing. Yeah, uh, Jalen, you said you got you closed out the win. It was a little chaotic. You guys lost the league, got it back. Uh, but does it feel like you guys are able to kind of fix that problem with closing games now? Uh, yeah, I mean, absolutely. You, in the NFL, you're going to face adversity. You know what I mean? Every week, it's never, it's never just going to be a walkout easy game. So... You know, like you said, it, it is good that we that we're facing this adversity, overcoming, you know, having to pull together and, uh, you know, ultimately finish out. Jalen, every time I look at the stats, you, you have like a touchdown bomb, two catches for like 80 yards or something, yeah. just like just like today. Do you, do you like being known as the, the deep threat guy or how do you kind of like that? What? I mean, I like I, just, I like being on the field playing ball, man. That's a any 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 way that they'll know me. I'm, I'm glad with it, man. I just love being out there working, winning, winning football game. You know, some people just think you, you got to run fast and run straight. But, you know, how does it play out for you getting those deep touchdowns? Um, yeah, I mean, being in the NFL period is much more than just running fast and running straight. But, you know, it works out how it's supposed to. We, we got a great scheme. I, th I think our coaches come into every week with a, a good with a good mind, like I said, with a great scheme. So, you know, as long as you know, I'm focused up, studied up, and uh, doing my job, you know, I, that, that kind of stuff, that kind of stuff falls into play. That's how it's, that's how the system works. Thank you, Jalen. Yep. Let's go to Cam Buford. Hey, Jalen. Hey, can you hear me, sir? I can. All right. Talk about a, that whole lot of chemistry you got with uh, your quarterback there and how, how that's developed from week, uh, from training camp to now, actually. Um, yeah, it's just been work. It's just work every single day. Just coming in, stacking one more brick on top of the foundation. Ever since, like you said, training camp, we've been out there putting in extra time, getting as many throws as we can during practice, after practice, before practice, you know, building building chemistry, building that trust. It's a big deal. But like I said, it's, it's just all work. Me um, and every single receiver, Mike, uh, Keenan, T. Bill, everyone has just been working relentlessly to get that chemistry because it's important in times like these. Will you um, elaborate on the chemistry, that, or not the chemistry, the leadership that your quarterback shows, uh, Justin shows throughout the game? Today you guys gave up 21 unanswered points, but then you came back and hit the big bomb with you. Talk about that leadership that he shows in the game. Yeah, um, it's tremendous. Uh, I think even the fans at home can see. I, one, one thing I, I like to uh, – point out in, in Justin's leadership as the season has progressed is just how he's been able to evolve as a leader um, from from the first game to this game. I just feel like each and every week he's he's uh, taking more control. He's got much more of a presence, he's taking more initiative. And uh, I mean, yeah, it's, it's it's tremendously important when, um, you know, like. Thank you. No, go ahead. I'm sorry. Yeah, no. Um, when you're just overcoming adversity to have a leader step up is is paramount. It, it has to happen before. Um, before you expect to before you expect to move forward. Thanks for your time, man, and good luck on your production. Yep, thank you. All right, Emmanuel Morgan. Jalen, um, how do you feel about your role in the offense um, and how it's kind of evolved since uh, week one? Can you say that one more time? How do you feel about your role in the offense and how it's evolved uh, since uh, week one? My role in the offense and how it's evolved? Yeah. yeah um, I, I mean, I, like I said, I, I say it a lot, but I'm just here to work, man. I'm here to come in, work, do whatever the coaches need me. If the rolling offense is, you know what I mean, they need somebody to you know, set an edge or a chip or, you know, pass protect or, or anything, catch deep balls, catch intermediate routes. I, I want to be here for that. I want to – I like to think I'm a guy that's just here to work and do whatever uh, the team needs for the W. So. For sure. Um, how, how do you feel your skills that kind of compliments um, Mike Williams and uh, Keenan? Um, you know, I think it's good. I think, you know, me being able to push, push the top off, get deep, uh, kind of alleviate some pressure and, um, uh, on, uh, you know, just, just on those shorter intermediate routes kind of opens up, uh, some of the stuff, like I said, in, in the intermediate passing game, in the short passing game, um, you know, can kind of help in the run game too, just, you know, in a basic sense that, uh, having a deep threat in football will help. Sure.
then Kai's Ka- a young guy. Um, you're stepping on making plays. Uh, so is Tyron. So is uh, Donald Parr. Um, how, how do you how do you guys feel about uh, being able to contribute to the team, uh, even though you don't have that much, that much experience? Um. Well, <laughs> we have been playing football our whole life, so we. You know, 20, 23 years of experience. It's not that we have no experience, but, you know, it is having having those leaders. I got this question a little earlier in the season, having leaders on the team at, at each position, um, at, uh, like in Keenan, having a leader in Dub, it really helps us young guys, me, T, Billy, everyone else, just kind of um, kind of compartmentalize the game, uh, relax, um, not think too much. It kind of helps us just in, just in the whole – whole aspect of the game it is it is a big part of um me and you know a couple a lot of other guys success having those leaders those older vets appreciate you yep all right Jalen we're all set appreciate it oh thank you